India has cemented its place as a major space power by successfully launching its first mission to study the sun. Three, two, one, zero. The Aditya L1 is on a mission to find out what causes weather in space. Finally, only 10 days after successfully landing a spacecraft on the moon, India has launched a pioneering mission to the sun. When the satellite Anditya reaches its final orbit, it will monitor the sun's atmosphere in greater detail than ever before. Lisa Farfel has more. Three, two, one, zero. This has India's latest space dreams. A rocket full of ambitions is aiming high. This morning, India has launched its first space mission to study the sun. Magnificent liftoff of PSLV C-57 with Aditya L1 on board. This satellite might take four months to get to its position, but here on Earth, the nation is already over the moon. So I think again, this is a, a fantastic achievement from India. If you could reach L1 uh, with the full observatory class mission, it will really open a new window altogether. It has seven payloads to study different aspects of the sun as a star, including the corona, a hot ring of gas around the sun. Now what is unique about this instrument? This is going to see the corona as close as possible from the disk of the sun. Less than two weeks ago, India landed on the moon and the nation made history. Today, they want to study the sun from a point about 1.5 million kilometers from Earth. There are limitations of looking at the sun from the ground because you can only see the lower atmosphere of the sun. So this was very, very important that we could go to the space. Having landed on the moon, India is now looking at the stars. Isa Farfur, ITV News.